May I toast my lovely bride? You may. May our days be filled with happiness and our nights filled with joy. <laughs> and, and, may we be accepting of our differences and tolerant of the things we can't change. I'll drink to that. <clears throat> so, uh, where are you guys going on your honeymoon? You know, things happen so fast, we haven't really even talked about it. We're both so busy, I don't know when we'd have time. Well, got to take a weekend anyway. Going to take us with you? Yeah. Can we go? She's only kidding, Bart. Kids don't go on honeymoons. Well, actually, my friend Tuesday's mom took her brother and her to South America when she got married again, and they all stayed in this little one-room hut. She said that she thought that it would bring them all closer together. <laughs> you know, that's not such a terrible idea. What, staying in a one-room hut? No, bringing the kids. I haven't had a vacation with them in years. And Barlow's going back to school. It'd be a chance for you two to get to know each other. But we'd have to have someone staying with them anyway. Well, it's just for a weekend. Whatever you say. <laughs> Where would you like to go? Aspen. Barbados. Hawaii. No, I think we should go to Aspen. Barlow. How about Lake Helgramite? <laughs> What's Lake Helgramite? Well, that's, uh, that's where we used to take the kids camping every year. You promised we could go last summer, but you had to work. Well, you know, we've never been camping. How does that sound to you guys? Lake, uh, what? Helgramite. Sure, why stand on tradition? Let's all go camping together. Can you believe it? They're taking us fishing to Lake Helgramite. Bottles of beer on the wall, 98 bottles of beer. If one of those bottles should happen to fall, 97 bottles of beer on the wall, 97 bottles of beer on the wall. If one of those bottles should happen to fall, 96 bottles of beer on the wall, 96 bottles of beer on the wall.
smart brass. Mr. Trout? Oh, yeah, old Mr. Trout. He's quite a legend around these parts. They call him Mr. Trout because he's been around so long. And nobody can catch him. I see. But I've got a secret weapon. Hmm. Well, Mr. Trout's days are numbered. Say goodbye to Lake Helger, my sucker. <laughs> morning. Good morning. Hey, Barlow, guess where you're going today? You're going fishing for Mr. Trout. He's not starting at Mr. Trout baloney, is he? Mm-hmm. <laughs> what about you, Christy? You a fisherman, too? Hey, guys catch him, girls cook him. Says who? Says my dad. Besides, Christy hates fishing. But do not. Do do. Do not. Well, maybe you'll make an exception today because your mother and I would like to have a little solitude. You mean, you're not coming fishing? Well, what if I caught Mr. Trout? You never forgive me. My dad always goes fishing with me. Hey, I got a great idea. Let's all go fishing together. Great. I'll go get my stuff. Hi, Laird. Gonna have breakfast with us? Oh, I'm not hungry, really. Well, you better have something. We've got a big day of fishing ahead of us. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'll catch up with you guys. Mom. You gonna eat, Erica? I can't believe her. She's bathing in the lake. Right out where anybody could see her. Good morning, everybody. Do we have enough food for one more? Well, sure. Good. This is my new friend, Buddy. This is my family. Hey, how is it? Buddy lives here, and uh, he wants to take us water skiing. Do you want to go, Erica? Uh, I don't think so. You could ride on the boat and be our spotter. Well, why don't you go? Mom. Well, it could be fun. We don't even know him. He's just some guy she picked up wandering around by the lake. He lives here, Erica. He's probably just trying to show you some local hospitality. You know, uh, the reason we brought you kids along was to try to bring you all closer together. Now, this... Uh, this might be an opportunity for you and Amanda. Hey, guys, if it gets any later, they're gonna stop fighting. Unless you'd rather spend the day with old Mr. Trout. I hope you don't think I'm gonna walk out there. Would you like me to carry you? Would you like my boyfriend to come down here and mash your face? <laughs> Shelter life, you know. I I need to. Uno mas por favor. 